live on the floor in San Francisco for AWS Summit. I'm John Furrier, host of theCUBE, here for the next two days back in person, bringing all the action. So let's talk about what's, what's going on now as you look at the landscape today. I like to think of our program as a catalyst for enterprise scale. Yeah. And through that, we provide visibility, credibility, and growth opportunities. The number one way things are made more easy is to make it more consumable by making it as a service, right? So yeah. it's designed specifically for Kubernetes. And the reality is, the faster you move with anything cloud-based, the better you are. And so there's this assumption that we've got to get it right the first yeah. time. In the cloud, if you start down your journey in one way and you realize midway that it's not the right place to go, it's not like buying a piece of iron that you put in the closet and now you own it. In the cloud, you can turn those services on and off. It's, it gives you a much higher density for making decisions and failing forward. Like if you have enough data, you can answer any question. And you know, if I can understand my data better than my competitor, then I've got an advantage. And so the question is, is, is how? What, what technologies and what skills do I need in my organization to, to allow me to do that? Give the data, share the data, because without the data, algorithms are useless. I can come with the best algorithm, but I got to train them, modify them, tweak them. Make them thought, better. Make them better. Yeah. And I think there are whole data exchanges the industry has not thought through something you and me talked many times. Yeah, yeah. I think the whole, that area is very important. Like this convergence of you know, societal trends with technology trends and how that manifests in our world around the way in which a product is built. And I think people really are realizing that the differentiation is not so much their application, it's their understanding of the data. Can I understand who my best customers are, what I sold today? If people came to my website and didn't buy, then why not? Where did they drop off? All of that they want to analyze, and, and the answers are all in the data. The question is, can you understand it? There's a lot that you can do with AWS, but focus is truly the key word there, because they're going to be able to find their little piece of real estate and absolutely deliver incredible outcomes for our customers, and then they can start their growth curve there.